I know you told the media if it wasn't for you, and you two, you and Alicia had been going back and forth a lot on social media, but you, you told the media if it wasn't for you, this fight wouldn't even have happened. Tell me why. Well, you guys know the second she won, uh, beat Perry Harper and won the belt, I was immediately calling her out. Uh, not because I had anything or had anything against Baumgartner. It was because I'm a champion. I go after the champions. That's what I do. I wanted to go undisputed. I have said that from the beginning. And so obviously I'm going to continue to do that. And uh, Baumgartner had the belt. So I was coming for her. And she tend to take it a little bit personally, you know, and told me that I was going to have to wait. She said, Mayor's going to have to wait. It's my time, the Baumgartner's time. And to me, that wasn't what true champions say when they step out of the ring. Uh, she never, she didn't say my name for months. She wanted to go after Choi, who has the WBA belt, and then fight me. But um, just like I couldn't get the fight with Choi, she couldn't get the fight with Choi. And Top Rank stepped up and made her an offer she couldn't refuse. So that's the gist of it. And um, it's on ESPN and Sky Sports, my network, just like I said it would be. And yeah. So I brought this fight to the fans in less than six months after she won that title. You know, you also uh, told the media that uh, this is the biggest fight of my life. Tell me why. Why is that? Every fight now is the biggest fight of my life because I've put myself in position. You know, I've been with Top Rank now for five years and uh, this is my 18th professional fight. And so I've put myself in position now and there's a lot on the line. Um you know, I think I just re-signed with Top Rank after winning that Hamadouche fight. And if I didn't, if I didn't beat Hamadouche in that fashion, you know, maybe I wouldn't have gotten an extension to my contract. And it's not just me. It's, you know, being a female in this sport still is still, it's challenging. It's not as, it's not as easy as a man because being a man, you just have to be a good boxer. That's not the case with women. Um, you got to sort of be hustling in other ways. You can't just ride off the success of one win it's like it's so you're always on the chop, choppy block I feel so um this is definitely the biggest fight of my life because uh this is going to propel me into the career and the life that I want to continue to, to live you know and so I want to go into as I've said that and she's the next step in that in that goal